This is gonna be so much fun. And at the end of this video, we're actually gonna have secret custom Lanky Box Hoppy Playtime jump scares to show you. It's gonna be lit. Yeah, guys, this is a very special video. Well, wait a minute. Who's that over there? Don't worry, Adam. Look, I'm Tristan, player from the game. I know, but dude, I think he's on me long legs. What? what? every single jump scare in Poppy Playtime. Okay, now we're looking at jump scares from Poppy Playtime Chapter 2 and we're ranking them, guys. So, oh man, the first one right here has got to be Wacka Wuggy because this is scary, but we've seen this before because it's Huggy. You know okay, what I mean? guys, let's see this jump scare. It's Huggy, but it, oh, there, oh, there it is. Oh, that's pretty creepy. Uh, uh oh, no, watch out, watch out. He's like twitching. Ah! was a good jump scare. Okay, now that's scary, but again, we've seen Huggy. Wait, this one's missing its teeth. Oh, it's just got gum. What? What was that? It was like... Oh, man, let's see that again. Okay. Now, I would say this is not super scary because, again, we've seen Huggy jump scare us before in Chapter 1, but it's scary because the anticipation. Right, like you never know which tube the Huggies are going to pop out of. That's what I'm saying. This one's pretty clear. Look at the yellow one. It's kind of funny looking. Yeah, it's kind of cute. Okay. Here we go. Up, here it comes. <laughs> there it is. Wow, okay, I'm gonna rank this one six out of ten. Wait a minute, dude, this one got no teeth. You think it's like a little baby huggy? Oh, oh maybe. It's like a little baby that lost its teeth and has just gums. That would make a lot of sense. I would rate this two baby huggies out of four adult huggies. <laughs> okay. Yep. Okay, next up is PJ Pugapillar, and this one is pretty scary. Okay, guys, let's see how scary this jump scare is. This one got us many times when we first played it. If you move when it's when the lights are on, you get jump scare. Wait for it, guys. Here it comes. Watch out. Don't move. Don't move! Ah! Whoa! Bro, let, let's see that one again, bro. Now, this is it's scary because PJ Pugapillar has that tongue. Yeah, he would slobber all over you. That's what I'm saying. Don't move. We're moving. We're moving. We're moving. Oh, what? It's like missing a head. Oh, yeah, like vanish. Wait, back that up, dude. Back that up. Oh, oh man. I didn't even notice his, his uh, nose is a heart. He reminds me of the dog of wisdom. Yeah. <laughs> mm, would you oh rather God. be oofed by yellow huggy without teeth or by PJ Pugapillar? Oh, I mean, this is actually pretty cute. It's just scary because it's like a giant caterpillar. He might put me in like a cocoon and I might blossom into a beautiful butterfly. Right, right. Okay, I would probably say this one was very scary. I like the anticipation, like with the music. Yeah. I'm gonna give this one an eight out of 10. I'll give these two caterpillars <laughs> out of six butterflies. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, next up, oh, it's Bunzo Bunny, man. You already know this one has to rank really high. This is like one of the first new animatronics you meet. It's really stressful. When it gets closer and closer and gets louder and louder. Yeah, all right, let's see it. We're just not pressing the color here. You can hear him getting closer. Getting closer. No, 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 no. Bunny's creepy. <laughs> Dude, he's kind of hitting the W pose. <laughs> that is creepy, man. Look at his teeth, man. See, baby Huggy, that's why it was the lowest rated jump scare because it had no teeth. The Pugga Pillar had teeth, but it had a little tongue. It was kind of cute. That's scary, bro. Yeah, I would not want to get bit by that Bunzo thing. Bunny will chomp you, and he'll probably take your head between the symbols and squish them. Let's watch it one more time. Bro, this is scary. And Mommy's in the corner. Oh, I didn't even see that. She's just watching. Yeah, this one, this one really scared us the first time we played the game. Uh, go away, go away. Uh, oh, you hear that? 
Yeah, like clamps down its symbols. At the end, it's like. Ah! Oh! It, it, it does. It, it goes and just squishes your head. Man. Ah. Uh, okay. This one's probably my favorite one so far. <laughs> I would probably rank this one. Man, honestly, like a nine and a half out of ten. Who do you think will win in a fight, Bunzo Bunny or Bugs Bunny? I think Bunzo Bunny would probably be able to win. I think Bugs Bunny would probably try to like space jam and try to like yep. dunk over Bunzo. Yep. Bunzo would yep. throw his symbol up and and block the dunk and then eat Bugs Bunny's leg. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> eat his leg? Yeah. Who do you think will win, Bunzo Bunny? Or Mr. Hops. That one's tricky. I think probably Mr. Hops. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Why? Uh, oh, well, probably because he would like try to um have Ruby also like attack Bunzo Who's Bunny. Ruby. Ruby's the girl from Mr. Hops. Oh, yeah. And then um while while PJ Pun while 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 well, Bunzo uh, Bunny uh, uh, while Bunzo <laughs> Bunny. Is attacking Ruby, that's a Mr. Hops would swoop in and probably bite Bunzo Bunny. There's so <laughs> You need to go back to school, Adam. What would you rank this one? I would rank this pretty high because this is scarier to me than Mr. Hops jump scare, which we've seen many times because we play Mr. Hops. So this is pretty scary. I would say this is three carrots out of four scary because it's a bunny. Wow, all right. Yep. Okay, let's see what's next, guys. These are all getting crazier. And yeah, guys, there's secret messages. I never really noticed this about the game. Sometimes when you oof, it says, the prototype has saved us. So that little claw, the scary claw that grabs mommy long legs, I guess it saves you when you oof. Mmm, okay. So the prototype might actually be friendly. That's like some secret, secret lore from Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. Yeah, all right, guys. Let's see. What is the next jump scare going to be? Oh, man. Oh, it's Mommy Long Legs, bro. Okay, Mommy Long Legs is very scary. There's a lot of Mommy Long Legs jump scares, but we've actually never seen this one. It, it, I don't think she ever caught us at this point in the game. Let's see it. Maybe she did. I don't know. She jumps out here. Yup. Ew. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that is really, really scary. Yeah, close she gets, bro. Yeah, and she doesn't have any teeth either. Dude, I just realized that. Are all the characters from Chapter 2 just like little babies? They got no teeth? Yeah, maybe after Huggy Wuggy, the scientists realized that they shouldn't add like sharp teeth to their toys because they just kept getting bitten, so all their future toys don't have teeth. What if Huggy Wuggy stole everyone's teeth? Because he has so many. Oh man, dude, that would be gross. That would be gross. Yeah, not cool, guys. Now, this jump scare, I would say it's not the best mommy long legs jump scare in the game from what I remember. I'm gonna give this a three out of 10. This one's so scary, though. Mommy's so creepy, dude. I, I, I gotta rate this, yeah, when she crawled up the walls. <laughs> <laughs> little spider mommy. Yeah, but she didn't really say much or anything. Like, yeah. I think she could have done a little bit better. Yeah, yeah, you're right, dude. I, I would rate this one mommy out of two spiders. Cool. Yep. Okay, another jump scare for Mommy Long Legs. This is the part where you got like grapple up and like Spider-Man up. Oh, this part's tricky. Or something. Oh, no, oh. no, no, no. This is where she just chases you. Is this the shredder? Yeah. Yeah, this is the shredder. Oh, so this is what happens if you don't put her in the shredder. Ah, okay, here we go. This part is pretty scary because it's a really long hallway and she like runs and chases you down the hallway and it's, it's really nerve wracking. Yeah. Okay, guys, watch out. Here we go. Here she comes. There she is. Ugh. It's the way she walks. Oh. Oh. And why does she make that oh like noise? That is the creepiest thing. I've never heard that before. That's the same sound Adam makes when he's going down to the fridge to get some bread. <laughs> Or after you got back from Taco Bell and you ate a bunch and you just kind of sit there like, oh. Bro, put the Taco Bell sound effect. <laughs> Bro. I know Taco Bell. Oh. Keep the crunch wrap supreme. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's me running to 
Taco Bell. <laughs> I'm running to Taco Bell. Dude, now I like this one a lot, but I still think Mommy Long Legs could do better. Are you serious? That oh, it was pretty scary, dude. It's uh, pretty creepy, but I would say this is probably like a six and a half out of are ten. Are you serious? That was scary to me. I didn't know she made that noise. Let, let me listen to that again. This is gonna scare you, Adam. Don't cry. All right, I won't cry. All right, I don't cry. Don't. Okay, yeah, that's creepy, dude. I don't like it one bit. Uh, nah, I, this one is very scary to me. I don't like this. I'll rate this three tacos out of Taco Bell. All right. Okay, what's up next? Oh, okay, we're falling. Oh, wow. Okay, I don't remember this part of the game. Oh, this is the jump scare where she jumps down and says to play hide and seek. Oh, this God. This is scary. <laughs> yeah, that's scary. I asked you to play fair, and you cheated. Great cheaters. Now, we're going to play one last game. It's called Hide and Seek. Ten. Nine. Oh. Seven. Six. She's counting down. Five. Four. Three. What? Two. Yeah, we've never seen that one before. Dude, that is so creepy. The anticipation, the way her eyes get all dark. And she goes, one! And she grabs the dude. There's also a secret here, bro. What? What's that? There's like, there's like a red reflection in her eyes. You see that? You see that? Yeah. You see that? Is that like our grab pack? No, it's not. Nah, what is that, bro? Yeah, guys. If you like zoom in and enhance that, there might enhance be, that image. There might be some secrets there. Enhance that image. Yeah. What is that? <laughs> that is so scary. You can still see it, bro. Wow. That is so scary to me. I, 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 we've never been caught by that one. Cause when we were playing hide and seek, we're really good. We never get caught. That's crazy. They like they blended the jump scare with her saying the number one. That's a ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. That's a ten out of ten. And the scariest part of this one is they trick you because they make you look up like you're going to grab that thing to get out of here and then she jumps down on you. That part always scares me. So it's almost like two jump scares in a row. I yeah, see, that's scary. And you cheated. Oh, great cheaters. Now we're going to play one last game. It's called Hide and Seek. Ten, nine, seven, six, five, four, three, two. That one's crazy. Yeah, that's a 10 out of 10 for sure. All right, let's see the next jump scare. This is the final jump scare. This is the max level one. This might be the best one. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about where you have to grapple up like Spider-Man and she gets you. Oh, man, here we go, guys. This one caught us a few times, guys, because we didn't know what to do the first time we played this game. She's right around this corner. You turn to the right and she's right there. Uh-uh. probably say that's like an 8 out of 10. I think the hide and seek one was like my favorite. That one was scary because she goes Aah! Right. You hear that? Yeah, like a pterodactyl. Yeah, watch this again. I think that's the scariest one actually because she doesn't even say anything. There's no jump scare. She just comes out silently. Right, that is creepy. Uh, it's either this one or the hide and seek one. The hide and seek one might be our favorite. It might be 10 out of 10. What would you rank this one? I would rate this two uh, out of three. Uh.
Alright guys, let us know which one is your favorite. Make sure to go check out LankyBoxShop.com and get LankyBox plushies. These were all crazy, Vlad. Yeah, well what do you want to do now? Vlad, we saw the craziest jump scares. We're gonna go eat some lunch. <laughs> <laughs>